flashback to the mid 90s, I worked for a tiny advertising agency in Tampa, Florida, and we had uh, bold ambitions and we wanted to drum up some business. So one of the things that we did was we looked in newspapers and for lo local advertisers, for people who are already spending money on advertising, we would redline their ads and tell them how they can optimize their advertising for better return. This was a great campaign. We sent 50 packages out to these advertisers with their ad inside, red marked with contact information. 20 of them got back to us. That's a pretty good return rate. We got meetings with five, and two of them became clients, Silk Plants Plus and Black Angus Steakhouse. From a tiny agency, this is a great way that got us some, some traction and some new business. And the reason why it worked is because we were helping the client understand that we knew something they didn't. It made the client curious when they saw their own ad redline that, oh, well, maybe there is something missing here. So we shined a light on a problem that they didn't think they had. This came to light for me just today. I was looking on LinkedIn. This guy sent me some photographs of some of my YouTube videos with red lines saying that it's not SEO optimized. This got me curious. Well, what's wrong? And he wrote back, well, here's what's wrong. That started a conversation. We actually spoke. And then now we're in negotiations on whether we're going to work together or not, which is a conversation he didn't have the day before because he shined a light on a problem I didn't think I actually had. Do the same. Peak curiosity in your customers and you'll have more conversations.